this video clip is going to show you how to use your change key to change the combination number. Now, I should warn you uh, that if you do it wrong, you could get in a little trouble. Uh, so try to be very cautious when using the change key that you do everything right. If you have doubts about your abilities to do it, uh, or if you have not uh, got proficient at using the combination number that's in the safe, do not attempt to try changing the, the combination number. If you need a little assistance over the phone, if you have purchased a sturdy gun safe, uh, you can call with your tag number. Our combination number on this safe is 30, 40, 50. Okay, you start out by dialing in on the 12 o'clock index line, which is this index here. This over here is the 11 o'clock index line. All right, let's get a close-up of the dial. We're going to dial in a combination of 30, 40, 50. Remember, it starts to the left. So you're going to go to the left three, well, four or five times would be the best. Okay, start to the left. If you wanted to go 100 times, it wouldn't make any difference. There is 30, your first number. Now, spin the opposite direction. You, you are now spinning to the right. There's 40 once. There's 40 twice. And there is 40 on the third time. The second number makes three showings at the 12 o'clock index line. Reverse direction, the last number is 50. There's 50 once. You notice I did not go all the way around the dial. 50 lined up within 10 marks. That's 51 time. 50 two times. Your basic combination is complete at this time. Turn the dial to the right as far as it will go. It should stop between 95 and 85 and it will stop dead. On most of the sturdy safes it will be 85. Uh, the black dials tend to be 95. The safe is now unlocked. We're going to dial a new combination number in a gun safe that has a combination already installed. Okay, the first thing is you open up the safe, throw the dead bolts out into the locked position, and cover up the 12 o'clock index line. That will uh, save you some grief. The most common mistake made is dialing one number into the 12 o'clock index line when you're trying to change. If you're changing the combination, this is the changing index line over here. And we're going to get a close up for you. Dial in the existing over here on the change index line. And here we go. At least four times around. You can go more times on that first number if you so desire. The first number is 30. There is 30 once. Or, excuse me, there is 30. Second number is 40. Once. Twice. And 40 on the third showing. Last number is 50. There's 50 once. Lines up quickly. 50 on the second time. Remember, the first number, at least four showings. The second number, three showings. The last number, two showings. Okay, do not turn the dial back for retraction because we're not trying to open. We are trying to change the combination number. Okay, at this point, you open the door up. 
Watch. This change key should go into the combination box to where this point right here is almost at the edge of the lid on the combination box itself. In other words, this little notch is just buried into the box. Change key is inserted. Rotate. Has a little click to it. You are now ready to dial in a new set of numbers. This one originally had 30, 40, 50. We're going to change it. We're going to go 60, 50, 70 on this combination number. It is one that I like uh, because it happens to be a speed dialing sequence. And it's, uh, it is because it will dial in quickly. Now, here again, we're going to go 60, 50, 70. I'm selecting a group of numbers that's in one quadrant of the dial. Okay, and the first number being 60. You go at least four or five times to your first number. And there it is, 60. Now your second number lines up quickly. Once. Twice. three times. Your last number is 70. It lines up fast too. Once. Twice. Remember the first number four times, the second number three showings, the last number is two showings. Now you are ready to open the gun safe door and we're going to turn the change key back and just turn it quickly evenly and pull it out all right now the new combination number that you've just set will be able to be used okay let's go to the front and i'm going to take the tape off of the 12 o'clock index line Now, dialing in a speed dialing sequence is fairly easy uh, because the numbers line up quickly. Uh, this one is 60, 50, 70. And here it is. Four times and the first number. The second number is once, twice, and on the third time, the last number is once and on the second time and back to the right with the unlock.